What spring anime of 2022 should you be watching? That is a great question, and why is there a monkey on my screen right now? The spring anime this year is more stuff than a kid at church with a lot of great shows returning, as well as some new promising titles like Spy X Family, which is one of the most anticipated anime to release. With a great studio... With a lot of great shows returning, as well as some promising new titles like Kawaii, Dakei, Ya, Nai, Shikimori-san. Or Shikimori's just not a cutie. Let's take a look at this trailer, shall we? Is that zero two? So we have our main boy out here on his morning yog, chasing that female interaction like we all do. And let's just take a step back real quick. Bro, look at those eyes! Damn, you ain't so bright, it lights up the back of her neck. Um, but have you seen zero two's eyes? Bro, go back and do your Shika dance and leave the culture people alone. Zero two's eyes looks like the pickle cucumber on a Big Mac, my guy. Why are you zooming in? Get this camera out my face. What are you doing? Nah, that is not the same design. There can't be one cute couple without this man getting yellows. See you in the next one. Huh? Did Shorty just... Swerve Dracoon? God? Yeah, with those eyes she might just be. <laughs> Bro, Purple Boy was about to be sent to fight some overpowered evil ass god with the power of friendship and Badusi. This chick just took 66 years of anime loss and stomped on them like they were nothing. I need to make a quick phone call. Yo, Eren, this chick just swerved Dracoon. Wait, what? And after all that, she grabs his face and spits on <laughs> And say, don't make me work so damn hard. Understood. Mother. Honestly, this girl might be able to rival with Morin. Just look at her! And here we have Bakugo, Umaru-shan, and Second Pick. The three side characters that no one gives a fuck about. <laughs> Bro, if this ain't a wife, I don't know what is. It's a drawing. I know. Here. Season 2 of Rising of a Morally Correct Person Looks like he's gonna top the last one With his overwhelming support and overwhelming amount of furries There is no way that this is gonna flop So apparently a huge ass tortoise finna walk the earth like it's the rumbling And it's up to Kirito, fuck this guy, Robin Hood and a very hot and masculine man to take it down And she could still get it any day Mad Kid is back with another banging intro Philo learned the move Beyblade And monkeys are here to take over what? Love is War is back with another banger intro. More frustration, Ishigami getting bullied, and... Shika. You get it all, honestly. It acts more like a comedy with a hint of romance. <laughs> it's been two seasons, 48 episodes, and these two haven't even held hands Don't yet. The new title, Ahadensan Vahakeranai, looks promising. Just by looking at the cover art, you can clearly see that this girl trying to steal Superman's whole style. And what is she doing? Yeah, so if you didn't know, these two are supposed to be the same age. I don't buy it. This girl is clearly put in the wrong classroom, while this man is just happy to be here. So this is basically just Komi-san. Lolly edition. Aw, oh, so wholesome. Kill it now. And speaking of Komi-san, season 2 is already dropping. I don't know what they be drinking over at OLM, but who really cares? The trailer looking crisp with everyone drooling over Komi. A stand user joins the fight. And whatever this is. My name is Izuku Midori. My DJ, yo, get on the case. Hey yo, Tadano! Data Live is finally getting its fourth season, with more people falling out the sky, Shido collecting girls like his Pokemon, and more Kurumi, which is the real reason we all here. Hello? And now finally, we are the last one. Yes! A couple of cockies. No! This show is girlfriend girlfriend if it went right. Like this is just a copyright waiting to happen. But at least homeboy over here picks one of the girls simping for him. And of course there's a sister, but not actually sister character. <laughs> it's not incest guys, it's not incest. Yes, yes, calm down, I'm gonna talk about it. Spy X Family is finally getting an anime adaptation. Hopefully Cloverworks doesn't do a Promised Neverland season 2. Because if another great manga get butchered, I don't think I will be able to recover mentally or physically, as my head will go through my wall. Anyway, this show is about a family where the blonde man is a a spy, emo girl is an assassin, and this small cute girl is actually a telepath. But here is the plot twist. They are not actually a family! <laughs> Everything is just pretend, like my social life. <laughs> In summary, cats are better than dogs. Thanks for watching, you made it to the end. Follow me on Twitter if you want to, it's a choice, but if you don't do it, I will find you. And this video looking kinda spicy, don't you think? Yeah, that's all for me. See ya!